Cinnamon Takzo here and welcome to another What The Facts video. What is up guys? This is Shinman Takzo again and what we're gonna do is we're going to see or we're going to answer that question about uh, which item is better for Ruby. Is it Has Claws or is it Bloodlust Axe? Let's um let's go to custom and then draft pick whatever. Okay, so let's pick Ruby. Alrighty, so we are at level 15 right now. Let's go ahead and sell everything we got. Uh, okay. Alright, so I don't have any items at the moment. Well, maybe we can buy uh, magic shoes. Okay, so which is better, Has Claws or Bloodlust Axe? Let's get Has Claws first. And then let's take some damage. What are the bonus lifesteal? We have 25% lifesteal, right? So, alright, so I'm getting 97. Oh, yeah, 98, 97, 75. Right, so that's what I get, right? 75 and, and 98. If I'm a little bit below the. Uh, Items passive requirement, which is 40%. Whoa, 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 wait. Okay, let's try our first skill. 137, that's a big jump, right? And then 105 from around 70 something. So that's the benefit that you get from Hash Claws on if you're low on HP. Now, let's sell Hash Claws and get bloodlust axe All right so we have bloodlust axe now All right so same thing first skill All right so that's was that wait i didn't see one more time 58 and 62 and then our second skill does 48 and 48 and you know, if you, as you can see, we are definitely below 40%. Bloodlust Axe doesn't have that additional effect. And the thing here is, it doesn't work with Ruby's passive at all. Now let me explain what I mean. Bloodlust Axe, uh, I mean Bloodlust Axe doesn't give you, doesn't give you life steal. Let me show you. Let me let me sell this. So I don't have Bloodlust Axe right now. By default, I have 15. 15% lifesteal, right? So if I buy Bloodlust Axe, nothing changes. 15%, I got Bloodlust Axe, axe there, and then 15% lifesteal. So it doesn't give you lifesteal. It doesn't work with Ruby's passive at all. Now, now the thing here, the thing that you see here, you know, the HP that I gain here is solely from from the passive of Bloodlust Axe, which is heals 20% of damage as HP to the hero. If we get we get Has Claws, our life steal turns into 35 because um, yeah, I mean it has life steal and it works with Ruby's Let's Dance. Every skill we cast, we can make use of that life steal. And since it's 35, not 20% like the Bloodlust Axe earlier, it's gonna be a lot stronger. Even if, if, if we're not below 40%. So what does this mean for Ruby when choosing an item? Or choosing which is best for her? There's, uh, there are other, other things you should consider as well aside from the lifesteal. It is the cooldown that Bloodlust Axe provides. It has this 10% cooldown reduction, so it'll help you cast your skills a lot, and you'll be able to life steal a lot. But like I said, it's life steal or Bloodlust Axe life steal. It's much much weaker than having has claws by a lot. 
yeah so I think that's it well thank you so much for watching and again my name is Shinman Takazo I'll see you in the next video peace